He's been in controversies before for ab abruptly adjourning the Rajya Sabha in 2011 when he was yes. chairman of the Rajya Sabha. The Congress government was likely to lose a vote. He did not observe the first International Day of Yoga in 2015. He has disrespected the national flag and he betrayed our intelligence officers in Iran when he was ambassador there in the early 1990s. I want to say something else. Even as Shri Ansari was venting his spleen at this Indian American uh, Muslim Council, in, which is based apparently in Washington, D.C., doctors at a super speciality hospital in New Delhi saved the life of a 12-year Iraqi boy born with a congenital defect that made his kidneys and ureters abnormally large. This was carried out via minimally invasive robotic surgical procedure. No one asked this boy, he's an Iraqi, his name is Ali, about his religion. This is the strength of India, Shari Ansari, which you don't seem to understand. You have proved that someone we thought was a colossus has feet of clay. Sir, do you have the courage to apologize to the people of India whom you've insulted? You have violated your oath to abide by the constitution and to protect the dignity of India. People are asking, are you an Indian first or a Muslim first? This webinar will remain on the international media till the end of time. How will you live it down? What will your children and grandchildren say when they hear about this? Sir, we know that as vice president, your closest aides were from minority communities. That was your choice. This organization, the Indian American Muslim Council, it gets funding from dubious sources and was linked to Pakistan's intelligence agency by the Tripura government in an affidavit in the Supreme Court about recent communal violence in the state of Tripura. By participating in this, sir, you have demolished your status and damaged the Muslim community in India.